Welcome to how to import brushes into Procreate. In this video, I'll show you how to download brushes on the iPad, both in Safari and Google Chrome. I'll show you how to download brushes on desktop and then airdrop them to your iPad. And lastly, I'll show you how to import brushes directly from Procreate. Let's get started on how to download brushes on the iPad from Safari. I'm going to my product page, clicking by now. And then I'm going to add my email and I'm going to fast forward this part. I'm just adding my payment info, clicking purchase. And that brings me to this order confirmation page. And at the bottom, you'll see the brush set. So you click on that, you get another option to download. And then from here in the upper right, you can click that little download button and then press on the brush set file. That will automatically open the brush set in Procreate. To check if the brush set was imported, you can open the brush panel by clicking on this little paintbrush icon. And then you should see the brush set in the left-hand menu at the top. If you need to access the link to download the file for whatever reason, you'll also receive an email that contains the link. To download brushes onto your iPad from Google Chrome, it's a similar process. You're going to open your browser, go to the product page, complete all the information, and then select purchase. The order confirmation page will appear, which has a link to the brush set. So you're gonna click on that brush set, and then a window will open at the bottom of the screen. Press download. Next, press open in, and a window will appear. So you're gonna look for Procreate, and if you don't see it, go into more, then you can search for it here. So you're gonna to wanna to select Procreate. This will automatically open the app and import the brush set. To so check that the brushes have been imported, Open the brush panel and you should see it at the top of the library. If you need to access the link to download the file for whatever reason, you'll also receive an email that contains the link. Next, let's look at how to download stamps on your desktop and then airdrop them to your iPad. So we're starting from the product page. I'm gonna add my information, put my payment info, and then press purchase. From here, it will bring you to the order confirmation page, which has a link to the brush set. So once you click that, it'll automatically download. If you lose this order confirmation page, don't worry, you'll also receive an email with a link to download the file. The file will either download to your desktop, your downloads or your documents. It really depends on your computer and your settings. But once you've located the file, it's time to airdrop it to your iPad. Before we do that, we wanna check out our airdrop settings on our iPad. So go to settings and then the airdrop settings are under general. So here I'm just going to click everyone for 10 minutes. Now back to your computer, right click on the file, click share, airdrop, and select your iPad. This is the window that will come up on your iPad. So you're gonna tap on Procreate. So automatically open the app and import the brushes. To check that the brush set has been imported, open the brush library and you should see the new brush set at the top. You can also import brushes directly from Procreate. So let me show you how to do that. Open the Procreate app, open the brush library at the top right corner, hit this plus icon, and then import. From here, you can search for the file. In this case, I have the file stored on my iPad. If you can't find the file, a good tip is to go into your Recents tab, and here you'll see all your recently downloaded files. So once you've found your file, tap it, and it will automatically import into your brush panel at the top of the menu. If you have any issues downloading and importing these Procreate brushes, please leave me an email at amikosimonetti.com feedback.